Tim Stump here for uh, Technique Peak from the Education Department. Just going to go over some traditional differences on the traditional method of doing rhythmic stabilization with your shoulder patients. So everyone knows, kind of doing some neuromuscular perturbation. They'll let me move you as the cue, and you can do it in different planes or different angles depending on where the lesion is in the shoulder or what you're trying to work on. Okay, so that's very traditional. Another way just to add variety or functional progression with your patients because patients are going to either A, mentally get bored, or B, you want to try to stress them for a physiological adaption, it's just use a uh, TheraBand loop, okay? So I can hold it here and move them around, they'll let me move you, and I can go all the way around this whole time, I can perturbate, I can hold steady, and then have changes of tension. And this is just a more advanced way. Obviously, you can do it in different planes of motion. Here, and try to work on it this way. To add uh, stress on the rotator cuff. And that's it. Hopefully, uh, you can find that to be helpful in the clinic. Thank you very much.